please subscribe to Face TV Africa and turn the notification on. Face TV Africa, Ejo, e subscribe, subscribe, eh, hete. Face TV. Uswobi. President Bola Tinubu has blamed his predecessors for failing to resolve the recurring farmers' heather's crisis across Nigeria. Tinubu said this in Abuja on Thursday when he inaugurated a presidential committee dedicated to the reform of the livestock industry and the provision of long-term solutions to recurring clashes between heather's and farmers. The establishment of the committee followed the submission of a report from the National Conference on Livestock Reforms and Mitigation of Associated conflicts in Nigeria. Speaking at the event, Tinubu said it is not the fault of herders and farmers that the crisis has persisted. It is the fault of the leadership who failed to find immediate solutions to solve their problems. Leadership is about thinking and doing. The president continued, out of every tragedy, if you are careful, you will see an opportunity. We have faced this conflict for some time. We know it is a homegrown problem it is very hard for people to stay away from their traditional old ways. I tried in 2018 to bring about a solution to this problem, but it proved elusive. But I've been told not to ever give up, and today I believe that the solution is here. The federal government is fully prepared to cover the cost of acquiring the land. These opportunities will provide gainful employment for our veterinary doctors while opening doors for the private sector as the provision of new educational opportunities for headers and their children emerge medical facilities will be established this is the life-changing opportunity that we have imagine us producing enough milk for our school children imagine us becoming net exporters of cheese and yogurt imagine us producing the skin massively with a major nigerian leather industry imagine us providing cold storage facilities and employment across the nation these things are possible in front of us. The president added, according to a statement by a spokesperson during Galale, we are not going to play politics, we are going to do the job. Recall that President Tunubu took over from Muhammad Buhari on May 29, 23. Buhari took over from Good Luck Jonathan after emerging winner of the 2015 presidential election. The tactics the president is using at this point in time, it is a very welcome development. If the government is going to take responsibility of acquiring the land, unlike what happened when it was the time of the former president uh, Buhari and also Gulo Jonathan in solving the header farmer clashes. Uh, the method being used by Jonathan different from that of Buhari and also Tinubu has brought in uh, a new method to deal with the clashes between the farmer and headers, creating an opportunity for jobs and also uh, opportunity for production of milk and leather it is a wholesome project that will bring about triple uh, advantages to Nigeria's economy and also to the farmer and the herder clashes. If you have land for these guys to uh, feed their livestock and also dwell and make one or two uh, production of milk and leather, it is going to be very, very good compared to when they go into farmlands of these farmers. Clash with them, killings here and there, cows are missing, lives are lost, and at the end of the day, the clash continues, the crisis continues and it's going to affect the government kidnapping, ransom, and all sorts. Communities are being burnt down. It's all sorts of things happening because leadership is lacking, according to the president, in this particular crisis. Let's wait and see. It's going to be the act, action of the federal government on this policy. Please subscribe to Face TV Africa and turn the notification on. Face TV Africa, Ejo, e subscribe, subscribe, e Face TV. Oh, Swoby.